wonder what's in there. At least I got you guys all nice boots, remember? Everyone has, like, super good boots. <laughs> so what do we fight in the sewers? Thieves, of course. Thieves love living in filth, I guess. Actually, the moving water is kind of cool. I think that's an upgrade from, uh, from Might Magic 6, if I had to say. So we've got thieves. They don't look like they're going to be very difficult. So let's just sort of shorten their lifespan even more. And uh, maybe we'll do one more fireball here. Just for fun. Is there a couple guys? That might have been just one person. Oh, well. He was really That'll teach him. <laughs> That'll teach him for living in filth underneath the city. <laughs> Mad with power and fire. Yeah, that's what you get. And we are getting... Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. That was fun. So there's some rats over there. They're not that dangerous. Apparently they can't get to us anyway, so... Okay. He kept running around and dodging the silly rat. So apparently these... Well, I was expecting that to take me back to the sewer. But as I was trying to say, is these walls teleport you. Kind of weird. Just a scratch. Again, I'm hoping we don't have anything important stolen. And that if I do, I'll notice. Perhaps I should auto-save it or quick save it. Alright, so there's some items, there's some enemies below us fighting some rats, I think. We've got three magic walls. And a passageway. We'll go this way first to another magic wall. Oh, no, a door. Okay, we'll let the rats and the thieves fight, because it seems the most efficient. Too easy. To let them fight it out. Now this is that a trap? I can't help with that. <laughs> it's not a very good sword. Okay, we'll go that way later. That looks possibly dangerous. <laughs> it also seems like every time we click a door, we go somewhere else. Oh, we can't actually go back. Okay, there's maybe there are one-way doors. Sometimes. Shows what I know. Can I just cast fly in here? This would be so much easier. Cannot cast fly indoors. I know. I can jump. I can cast the jump spell. I could just I could cast feather fall and just jump down. But that seems like a one way ticket. I don't want to go there just yet. So let's quick save it and see what happens. Scratch. Yeah, it casts acid sparks or acid shower, poison spray or something. Some spell that's green goes. <laughs> All right, it's got to be rats in here for sure. Oh, oh, you know what? I found the entrance. This is where we started. Okay, so that was the first wall that teleported us, and then we haven't actually. That's that's where we ended up coming down. Okay, so let's take this first teleporter again. There really wasn't a whole lot of options here. And then we teleported here. That makes sense. Okay, cool. So that's the teleporting method to get here. If you want to be up here, at least. We also know that you can... Uh, still got hit. We could just walk up the old-fashioned way from that sort of route. Alright, what happens if we go this direction, then? We find a whole bunch of uh, thieves and rogues. Dastardly villains. And then they all died. Serves them white. At least they killed the rats. It's nice to know they're stronger than rats. <laughs> Alright. Do 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 do. <laughs> sure. Pick up the belt. <laughs> nah, that's, that's not worth it. So probably one of those up high, uh, across the trap floor... Uh, doors is probably where we ought to be going. And it's back this way. Actually, again, I should cast, uh... Wizard's Act. I should keep that on in general, just so I can find stuff. And I should probably remember to do Torchlight so you can see easier. <laughs> so there's a lot of enemies down here we haven't been to yet. We haven't been down there. Oh, I picked up the stupid sword. I didn't want that, actually. Tell you what. You guys down there, you can have a sword. Hope you guys are happy. So we came in from that side. We've come that way now. Let's try, let's just get to the right. We'll see where that takes us. And uh, maybe I'll do a little bit here. 
sewers don't seem too large. Looks like a one-way jump. Have we been in here yet? Probably. That's probably nowhere useful. Although, wait a second. Haha! -ha! What does this thing do? Apparently nothing. I saw it on the map. It looks like maybe it can shoot something, like a trap or something, but... Also, there was a... Uh, Interesting. I was expecting this to, like, shoot something at me while I put this lever up. But at least I saw the lever, so that was something. Alright, and then this is a trap, right? Can I like, jump over it? Ha-ha! Take that trap! I'm actually glad we got all this perception. So, I imagine it's platforming. That moves that back. Okay. There's nothing. Oh, that lines it up a little bit better. Not quite, though. You want to go... I don't know where go. Not that way, for sure. Okay, how about this one? No, that's definitely the wrong one. Alright, we've got a lever puzzle. It's good times. It seems like mostly they like, they like to push that middle one backwards. And this middle switch seems to do nothing. Okay, that's fine. Is that as good as I can get it? Maybe there's more... You know what? I bet you there's like more switches on the other side. And I bet you what I had there was probably as good as it could do. And then once we go to the other side, it'll probably move that over or something. And we'll be able to walk across. That's my guess. Jump! Okay. Got that switch. This thing still doesn't do anything. There's still enemies below the five-way path room. We'll try the center route. Actually, it's six-way, isn't it? Yeah. Pause the game. Pause the game, Blue. Take it. Weakling. That was too easy. Definitely could have come here earlier again. <laughs> Another dungeon that's not super difficult. That's fine. Get the easy ones out of the way, right? And then when I'm pulling my hair out with the dangerous dungeons, I'll be uh, mentally prepared. So this is a way out. Um, let's just save. I don't know where we're going. We need to this takes me under that bridge. Okay. Some robbers, whatever. Not really interested in fighting robbers out there. I don't know. An axe. I don't know if we've been down in this room yet, but I don't think there's a lot of reason to go. There may be a path below us. Whatever. Let's keep exploring the... The room of six doors. We only got two left. Keep getting hit every time we walk through, though. It's kind of too bad. Thought someone was following me there. <laughs> the red dot on the minimap. Okay, is this another one of those? Uh, yeah. No problem. Look at this, guys. I am totally good. Come on. Come on, kill him. There you go. You want to fight? Too bad, you're already dead. And like Blue was expecting, more switches. Not quite what I wanted. So that's a path. That will take us to that one specifically. I don't know which door we need to go to. There's three. It's possible this is the only one we can get to easily. And it's also possible I've messed it up. Okay, I've got everything but those two. Come on, don't totally. Oh wait, when I click that, that one went up too. Did you guys see that? Weird. I had it, you know, I had it that one time, I should have just left it alone, shouldn't I? Oh, that one's going away again. Shoot, does that mean I have to go to the other side again? Just keep clicking switches all the time until it goes where I want it to go. Yeah, those ones seem to alternate whenever you click one. But everything but two. There's one right here, and there's that one. I just can't quite get them all synced up. Hmm. 
All right, let's get everything but one. Yeah, it's pretty close, and then I'll try the other side again. Shoot. I should have just quit when I was ahead. I know. I know. I was thinking maybe I could line it up to a different room, but I have a feeling there's only one we can really get to. We'll check that door out first. Take some damage. Just to see what's over here. It could be treasure or something. At least, there, yeah, there's actually treasure, in fact. I was in, I was completely correct in my assumption. Got it. <laughs> Not good treasure. You'd think the thieves would have better loot down here. Got it. This is actually really <laughs> poor. That's not even as good as that one chest outside of uh, the Barrow Downs. That was good. Come on, just kill it. Alright, so then this may connect up with all these other underground routes. Okay, so probably what this uh, door we just went through up above was, was the way out if you fall down, basically. Lousy axe, nothing else. Yeah, I bet you that's all it was. Okay, I think I've got this place nailed down. We're actually in green mode, which means we've probably killed basically everything now. So we're going to go, I think it was this way? It's just a scratch. scratch. Yep, I actually remembered the direction. Good, good. Jump. And I'm really hoping I can fix this puzzle. Because I did have it one time, and then I messed it up. I need that thing to go over there. Can. I have a feeling this block is only from the other side control. Drat and bother. So this is exactly what it was when I got here. That's not good. Okay, so that's everything but one. I must need to go to the other side to finish it. Bear with me, folks. Uh, maybe this episode's been going on a little long. I just want to finish this off. Mostly I just want to finish this dungeon and... Uh, possibly get started on Klonoa's uh, promotion quest. That's my goal, but you know how it is. Sometimes these things, they take a little bit longer. Let's also save. I'm tired of running around. Let's try that one. Not quite. Maybe. No, that's definitely not right. I just don't want to hit the right switch. It seems to mess everything up. Why can I not get this anymore? Why can I not get this anymore? That moves that back and that forward. Oh, no! Oh, then I felt, that's why we auto-saved it. How did I walk over that ledge? I just walked right over it, actually. Like, totally weirdly. Uh, let's re-put torch light on so you can see. That just moves everything around all willy-nilly. Okay, I'm going to pause the video until I figure this mess out. This is horrible. Okay, the good news is I solved the puzzle. Uh, and I finally got everything lined up. I think we actually have to teleport to that and walk across. Judging by the map. Because I don't think I've been up in that room yet. So, uh, that is the plan. <laughs> That's the plan, Stan. Do you guys remember how to get there from teleporting? I uh, do not just recall off the top of my head. <laughs> Ah, uh, this has been not a horrible dungeon, but um, definitely not the simplest. I think left or right. Let's go back. Just a scratch. Seem to get hit a lot by that trap. Okay, so this was the teleporty part. Uh uh, and then I'll just fall down anyway. That's totally not really what I wanted to have happen. Ah. Uh. Back up. Get back up. Don't let him kick you down. So how did I get back to the teleporty section? That was the question. It's, just a flesh wound. it's not up, it's actually down, so it's probably this way. I need to go back into the water and up on the other side. Shoot, I totally forget how to get around now. I spent so long doing the puzzles that are much lever pulling that I've kind of forgotten where the entrance was. Oh, that's not the entrance. This is definitely not the entrance. Okay, I'll meet you guys. I'm just tired of backtracking. I'll see you guys once I figure it out. Okay, I don't know why I was having such a hard time. But basically, I think it's that wall. Yeah, and that took me exactly where I needed to be. Because if I touch the wall again, it takes me back to the other main section of the dungeon. Which is not where we want to be. So, we're good now. Woohoo! What do we get for our trouble? Some dead rats? And a door. 
Litter for Mr. Stanley. Sure. <laughs> Stan Lee or Stantley, I guess. Dear Mr. Malwick, I have not heard from you in some time. Recruitment. Basically, Markham must be handled and then Halmondale will be ours. Okay, something possibly important that we'll have to keep our eyes open on, our eyes on in the future. Lots of barrels and stuff. Purple! Speed or accuracy? Accuracy. Speed. Wrong. Yellow. Then that is accuracy. Yes. <laughs> Pick that up. Purple barrel. We know his speed. Give it to the mages a little bit. It's disarmed. Good work, Klonoa. <laughs> Not very good at finding good stuff, though. <laughs> A trident that is basically just a pitchfork. Blue is for personality. Look at me remembering. More personality. And accuracy. Shoot, wrong one. <laughs> I keep getting accuracy and speed mix. And I think we got one more chest. It's disarmed. Barely. Alright. Hello, Master Thief William Lascar. We have learned this is actually the Drag the Dagger Grandmaster as well. So if we'd come in here if we'd come here earlier, we could have picked up I suppose disarm, which I was looking for. So that's probably good. Master Thief. Uh, undisputed ruler of all he surveys even. Huh. What about that dark bit over there? <laughs> uh, let's be rogues. The law may decide who is guilty and who is not. He decides who is called thief and who is just a criminal. So he would like a lovely vase from the mantle of Lord Markham's Manor. And it will be a rogue. So I believe we have our quest for next episode. <laughs> and unfortunately, it's kind of a pain to get to this guy's room. I mean, hopefully these sewers don't respond too quickly. But uh, it is a bit of a bother to get back here. Now I want to go... I think the exit was right there that I came in on. So I jump down and go that way. Yeah, this was the sewer bit that I kept missing when I was wandering around looking for the secret, the shortcut. And this was actually the starting room, but because that wall was in the way, it confused me. So, there we go. Escaped. Woohoo! We're free! So, uh, I suppose this is probably a good point to wrap up. It's probably been a fairly long episode by now. I keep losing track of the time with all these pauses. Uh, next time, we will try to get uh, Klonoa promoted, and then maybe we'll try to get um, Water Mastery now that we've got all this money. So thanks for watching, folks. I hope you have enjoyed, and have a great day.